what do we see right now? Uh, the processes in many health organizations are uh, really outdated and they're lagging behind of the industry in engineering section or IT. We cannot stay in one place for long. We must change, we must evolve and uh, be brave to trust the technology. I'm a clinical psychologist and I have always wanted to uh, design better treatment for people working for anxiety disorders. And one of the problem is you have to help patients face their fear, what we call exposure. Exposure is practical because it works, it's the key ingredient, but it's also complicated. Uh, for example, fear of flying, uh, it means that patients have to take the airplane. And fear of height, it means that we have to go to high places. People are very reluctant to seek help, especially with mental disorders. And that's why gamification was such a big deal. Gamified processes makes us more willing to participate. And that's the most important thing in any therapy. You don't need specific facilities. Everything is in the box, essentially. You bypass the need to using imagination. But developing virtual environments is costly. Governments and medtech companies, they are afraid to invest because they're not sure if it's working or not. The easiest way how to overcome the bureaucracy is to create product and show it that it works. We know uh, the, the technology, there is a good need, and this is exactly why we chose to work, to invest to mental health virtual reality. And it helps uh, all the therapists, doctors, uh, analysts, and the patients themselves. We need as a therapist to get to that touchy, difficult, hard to get moments. And because a therapist can see uh, what the patient is going through, we have control environments where we can help people live situations that are emotionally challenging and we can adjust the level of complexity to get more effective success in therapy. You can safely explore so much things that you just simply could not do in the real reality. It changes the way how mental health uh, have been working before. Technology changes us, who we are. We don't accept those changes sometimes. Uh, however, as you know, the change is life. Technology is the best friend of the humanity. Pushing the boundary of the humanity. It is enabling us to change effectively.